Here I am in Florida at my, the site of Elizabeth's Secret Garden, and I'm going to give you a tour of my vegetable and herb garden. First, we'll start, and I'll show you my pumpkins. Here they are. I have a total of four. Two of them I've already picked. You can see they're huge. They're probably two pounds in weight. And they're starting to get yellow spots, and they'll soon get ripe so we can pick them. And here I have some flowers. And this is my basil bush that I started from seeds. And the bumblebees and honeybees really like to pollinate it. Over here, we have the passiflower. This is the host plant of the gold fritillary. And I have parsley. Oh, here's spinach. Here's spinach. And I have broccoli. Here's marigold. This keeps away the nematodes. Oh, and green beans. Look at these pods over here. We eat a lot of green beans. I pick them and then we boil them and we have like a Mexican dish. And over here I have eggplant. This one has one on it. I'll show you my other one which has eight eggplant on it right now. Let's see. I have pintas. Here's my peppermint plant. We like to make peppermint tea. Oh, stevia. This is a really special plant. It tastes like sugar. You just pick the leaves off and eat them. I think I'll have one. Mm. And here's mint. And oregano. Oregano is really good for Italian dishes. And over here I have more flowers. This is Black Eyed Susan. Here's rosemary. I like to put rosemary on our hamburgers. And here is my other eggplant. This is just a big, giant, daddy plant. It has, I probably picked uh, four already, and it has eight on it right now. I'll show you the biggest one. This is Black Beauty variety. Here it is. Ooh, yes, that is a beautiful eggplant. Straight from the Florida Garden. And here, the flowers are just beautiful. They're purple. Look at that. And here is Sweet Majorum. It's an herb. It's very aromatic. And, oh, my favorite herb is lemongrass waves in the wind. It makes great tea. They have it in Costa Rica. And this giant bush is my porter weed. The butterflies really go crazy over it. And the hummingbirds like it too. And continuing, I'm not done yet, this is the other section of the vegetable garden. I planted six tomato plants because I never have had much success with them, so I wanted to be sure that I get tomatoes this season. And these are beefsteak tomatoes. They're just incredible. They have the funniest shape. Here, look at, it's like a bumpy kind of form. There's lots of those. And then I have zucchini. So all zucchini. No flowers right now. Strangely, you can eat squash and zucchini flowers as long as you don't eat the stamen. It's not very tasty. It has pollen on it. And here is my sunflowers. I've already picked, I believe, four or five in the squirrel. I fed them to it. And it has little babies that it feeds with the seeds. And here are my cucumbers. Dad and I made this big trellis out of PVC pipes and wire. 
from the weight of the cucumber just a little dented. The one fruit I actually am growing, other than lemons, is strawberries. They sent out a bunch of what they call runners, which rooted, and they'll start new plants. And that is Elizabeth's Secret Garden. Hope you enjoyed this tour. Bye.